hello guys welcome to my channel in this video I will show you the error okay if I go to here speaker icons you can see the error uh, no speaker or headphone are plugged in okay so I'm getting it the red error you can see here and audio is not work working on my windows let me zoom it you can see here okay and the error is this one so how to troubleshoot this issue okay first you need to right click on that and we will troubleshoot it okay click on troubleshoot problem and uh, window will automatically try to resolve your issue okay uh, let me close this option and go to start menu click on settings okay click on update and security option and you will see this option troubleshoot this is the option troubleshoot and then you need to click on this option which says additional troubleshooter okay click on this option now you need to click on this option playing audio okay and run the troubleshooter let's wait and it will try to resolve your issue automatically if not we will move move to the second method okay let's wait whether it will resolve the issue or not scanning for hardware changes okay so troubleshooting could not identify identify the problems so i have to close this option okay let me scroll it down whether anything about okay recording uh, audio you can also run the troubleshooter as well since uh, this is also related to the okay but it is not directly related to the audio but uh, you can also run this troubleshoot as well okay troubleshooting could not identify the problem same error i'm getting let me close this option okay and go to services okay here go to services option okay type as services you will see it uh, run it as an administrator here And once it is open you need to look for windows audio okay so press here w and look for windows audio here is the windows audio you need to look for this option okay in my case you can see here it is not running and seems it is disabled you need to right click on that and go to its properties and uh, first startup type select it automatic here like this and let me apply here then ok ok and click on selected option and start the service ok click on start sometime it is if it is disabled that your work audio is not going to work and now check if your audio is working or not in the third method we will go to the device manager type a device simply device and click on device manager option this is open it and look for audio services here okay uh, okay this option sound audio video game controller expand this option okay uh, here if you find any services related to the audio you need to right click on that i am not getting it all here and click on right click on that update search automatically and make sure you are connected with the network okay 
but I am not able to get it here ok uh, go to scan and click on scan for hardware changes if some hardware changes were made ok still not able to access the related to the audio service here if you are able to find it out you can uh, upgrade those drivers ok and update it mm, still the same problem I am not able to solve it yet but we will resolve this issue step by step the issue is related to the hardware it seems one thing we can also do we need to go for a browser and then type a realtek high definition audio driver ok Realtek high definition audio driver and open it high definition audio driver for windows and click on this option if the driver is not listed on your device manager you need to download the driver ok scroll it down and click on this option download accept terms and conditions now this is the real tech for windows 10 and you can also uh, find it for any other version of windows you need to just change it to the like this I will show you for windows 7 if you are using and you will be able to access it here here is all the versions you can see here windows 7 8 8.1 you can download the driver from here as well uh, this is the pc audio codex high definition audio codex and this is the website ok this one is the website you can see here ok and uh, we have successfully downloaded the zip of audio driver let me go to download and we need to unzip it first click on extract here right click on that ok I finally found it from here audio win 10 double click on it and scroll it down and this is the setup ok this is the setup we need to double click on that and click on yes let's wait now the realtek high definition audio driver is installing ok click on next ok you, you need to restart you will see the message yes I want to restart my system so let me click on finish and my system is going to restart then we will check whether the issue is solved or not ok after the restart still getting the same error it is uh, you can see here the same error ok I still can't find it so we need to go to the BIOS option ok this is the last option we can try before formatting your system we'll go to BIOS and sometime if the services is disabled from the BIOS we can enable it go to BIOS key I am using Dell laptop I will press F2 if you are using uh, HP then you should press F10 or other in the Dell laptop the same you can press 
uh, sorry in the Lenovo laptop I'm talking about you can google it uh, here we are in a BIOS and go to system configuration here whatever laptop or the system you are using you need to look for audio option okay click on audio and after that uh, here is the error okay uh, this is disabled from the BIOS so I need to click on here enable option okay then click on apply and let's see it will resolve issue or not and click on exit uh, whichever laptop and whichever the windows you are using you need to look for this option audio in the BIOS okay before formatting your system a fresh installation is the last method you left after this method okay okay now you can see the icon is back okay it means that uh, my audio is disabled from the BIOS and you can see here I am getting this and since we have already installed the uh, Realtek driver on it so let me go to device manager audio this option now you can see Realtek audio I am getting here so hope your issue is also resolved now if you are still getting the same error you need to reinstall your windows and check if your issue is solved or not so hope this video is useful for you if yes then hit like subscribe and share thank you thanks for watching